Yo, what's good, homies at home? That's your boy RC here. Get ready to react to WWE's funniest moments. You lose, you laugh. You laugh, you lose. I mean, by Apex Predator series. Can't wait to get into it. I know it's going to be good, entertaining, funny. Um, let's go ahead and get into it. I'm going to try not to laugh. Technically, this is a try not to laugh challenge. So I'm going to try my best not to laugh. Be sure to smash that like button, leave a comment, subscribe, share. Um, suggest me any type of video you want to see in the comment section down below. Be sure to stay active on the channel. Let's hop into the video right now. Can you dig it, dig it, sucker? sucker? I'm not trying to get copyright. I'm not trying to get copyright. Thank you, Apex Predator, but really ain't about YouTube's political bullshit type of thing. I don't want to get copyright, so, like, come on, like, it's YouTube, bro. Let's go back to the video. So it's snowy Green Bay report. <laughs> That's a smirk. That's not a laugh. They say you laugh and lose. I ain't laugh. Believe it or not, I've seen this one happen live. I feel so sorry for King. I could picture Edge being bald right now. I could actually picture Edge being bald. And you know what, Kurt Angle. I, Kurt Angle bald is just cause like I mean that's another story for another time Kurt Angle's bald actually is not that bad looking but I can actually picture Edge bald I don't know why he got the short haircut thing going on right now but I can actually picture him bald with like a, um, one of those beards that grow out like Big Show and Braun Strowman I don't know why but I can actually picture that in my mind let's go back to the video I may suck but you just won't <laughs> So I remember that right now. Had invoked their automatic rematch clause last week. And so more, I still can't believe he did that. Like I still can't believe he did that. Look, this is hard. He's looking like I deserve better than us. Like working with Enzo Amore, like a lot of people say he was difficult to work with. He thought he was a bigger star than what he really was. And you know what? WWE, as far as WWE goes, you're you're disposable. Like. Um, there's literally like once they let you go there's literally like a hundred people waiting in line to take your place on the roster so Enzo thought he was a bigger star than what he was and WWE proved that he was disposable and they disposed of him but let's get back to the video Bob Backlund come yes, on my dad owns Mr. Hero, really? but calm down you'll get your Romer burger later Whoa, that's messed up. That's that's nice, but that's messed up. I seen that so many times. I came to laugh at Mal Hardy. I seen that so many times. Oh God! Uh oh! Mm -mm. I'm not gonna laugh. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna laugh. I'm not gonna laugh. Talk about identity crisis. Something right now. They are so mean to Lillian Garcia. They are so mean to her. And this is not me laughing. This is me smiling, trying not to laugh. This does not count. That's laughter. And this Titus O'Neil clip, I've seen it so many times to the point where I can't even laugh no more. I feel sorry for my bald head chocolate man. I feel sorry for him. But let's get back to the video. I can't laugh. I really can't. Oh my God! What the heck? What did Titus just? I see it so many times. Oh my God! Did that happen? Yes, it did. Yes, it did. That may be the greatest thing I've ever seen. That may be the greatest moment in Royal Rumble history. I've seen it so many times. I can't laugh. Already powering through, going up top. Oh, I remember this spot. Gender's still stuck with it. He's still stuck with it. Hey, that's when I first won the WWF. Oh, this is cool. That's us. We're gonna be together. Oh, this is so cool. See you there later. The birth of the Usopp chance. Yeah, they did. They put their impression in the man. I am trying to figure out what Kali's trying to do. By the way, Kali, it's not a man. That's messed up. I have seen this too. The DX 
rated RKO feud was actually great. I loved it. I enjoyed it. I remember watching this during my teenage years watching WWE. It was just entertaining to see both of them. Four future Hall of Famers. Well, you know what? Triple H, Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels, Edge already in the Hall of Fame. Randy Orton and Triple H definitely going in the Hall of Fame one day. But it was still entertaining to see the little skits they would pull between each other. The childish high school antics made it all the more entertaining. Then during the match with each other, Triple H tore his other ACL or MCL. He he tore up his knee pretty much. I mean like or his quad I think I don't know. Let's get back into into the video though. Triple H is still a beast though. He still is. I seen that video so many times too. I can't even really laugh at that. Ladies and gentlemen, attention please. It seems that we have a lost child at ringside. Where? Please come and pick him up right now. Why they clown James Ellsworth like that? That's not even funny. I seen that. It wasn't funny when I seen it. And this ain't funny. I seen this so many times. That's not even funny. Kane doing the spell run is just awful. Come on, Mark Henry's trying. Come on now. Stunner's just a walking botch. <gasps> the debut of the beach ball and Stone Cold. Look what Stone Cold did to beach ball. This is what all wrestlers should do when fans start tossing around beach ball and lands in the ring. They should just kick out the ring and pop, or, or pop it. Let's get back to the video. The, de the earliest known debut of the beach ball. Even my least favorite superstar, The Miz. He's everybody's least favorite superstar, to be honest. I chance of getting a WrestleMania match than John Cena. You spoiled brat, sanctimonious son of a bitch. Ooh, nice. Jericho as a hill is just brilliant. That's not even funny. I've seen that so many times. It's not even funny. Why? Why? That's the second time Kane has tripped in this video. You know what? Kane's like what, 51 years old? I mean, like, come on now. He's old. He can't stand on his feet for long. I mean, he's trying to become mayor. I think he's mayor of Knox County, Tennessee, right now. He needs a job where he can kind of just sit down and take a breather, where he's not in the ring, like. And flying planes and signing autographs 24 7. I mean, like I said, he's 51 years old. I'm surprised he hasn't injured himself yet. But let's get back to the video. That's Let's get back to the video. Why do you despise me so? Because I can get on all the rides at Disneyland and you can't. <laughs> and you. Oh, uh, here we go. Joey Mercury. Which brings me to Mr. Seth Rollins. Please, can't even can say anything about John Mucker. AJ Styles. Oh, this shit's guy. Sorry. Sorry, no, no speak, speak English. English. Mm -hmm. I've seen that so many times. It can't even make me laugh. Right the oh, Goldberg's trip at SummerSlam 03. Mm -hmm. I've seen this so many times too. Lillian was rocking those heels. Now, I say that girl, you keep doing your thing. She was rocking those heels. But that trip and fall, I mean, I seen JBL two step down the ramp. He was two stepping and he fell. I mean, you're from Texas. You should automatically be able to do that without falling. I mean, that, I think people in Texas learn how to step at birth. Let's go ahead and get back to the video. <laughs> wow! What the? Kozlov all tied up here. Oh, how intimidating. Green Bay wins What's up? Our truth, we're in Milwaukee! WrestleMania 30, right here in the Silverdome. I can't believe I'm no, the no, Paul Nope. I'm sorry, it is the Superdome, brothers. 
I'm excited too. Randy Orton is not. Oh, and congrats for, to Hulk Hogan for getting put back in WWE Hall of Fame. I mean, I don't condone what Hulk Hogan said at all, especially being a black man. But still, as a wrestler, he definitely deserves his place in the Hall of Fame. Because this guy, if it wasn't for Hulk Hogan, WWE would not be on the map like he is today. If Hulk Hogan had stayed in AWA, like American Wrestling Association, instead of taking Vince McMahon's offer back in what, 83, 84, who knows? Von Gagne and the AWA could be on top right now, and WWE could be like a distant two. But um, let's go ahead and get back to the video. Not really a part of the authority. <laughs> I really want to laugh right now. But that was the last clip I made it. I smirked a lot. I didn't like smile, but I did not laugh. It says, you laugh, you lose. You laugh, you lose. I did not laugh. I made it. I won the Try Not to Laugh Challenge. Okay? Boy. But I definitely enjoyed the video. Definitely used some older clips were a trip down memory lane for me. I enjoyed it. Definitely sparked my memory about wrestling. I, I'm a big wrestling fan. I love wrestling. It could be WWE. It could be WCW, the original ECW, not the shit storm. Like Vince McMahon's like, um, version of ECW. New Japan Pro Wrestling, Ring of Honor. I'm starting to get into. Uh, I like Impact Wrestling. Love Impact Wrestling more in WWE, to be honest. Now, if only they could get a bigger arena, but that's another story for another time. Um, Lucha Underground. I'm just into like a lot of wrestling, but I definitely enjoyed this video. Be sure to smash the like button, leave a comment, subscribe, share. Suggest me type of video you want to see in the comment section down below. Be sure to stay active on the channel. Until next time, much love. Stay cool, y'all. Peace.